This is a demo for AWS Marketplace for Containers Anywhere with Kassen K10 by Veeam. With the new Marketplace for Containers Anywhere, if you search for Kasten in the AWS Marketplace, you'll notice a new listing called Kasten K10 by Veeam Hybrid Deployments. This is the new Containers Anywhere model for licensing Kasten K10. In this demo, we've licensed 10 nodes of Kasten K10 that can be used by any Kubernetes cluster, whether that's AWS EKS or any external cluster. If we click Continue to Configuration, the first demo we'll show is how we deploy this on an existing EKS cluster managed by AWS. If we click Continue to Launch, we'll get our uses instructions for how to install this new license into an existing EKS cluster. All we need to do is follow the on-screen instructions from a command prompt CLI in our EKS cluster. Quickly apply these commands to an existing EKS cluster to enable this new licensing model and install CAST in K10. Once CAST in K10 has been installed, we'll validate all the pods are running and then we can launch the Casting K10 user interface for the first time. The first thing we do once we're into the Casting K10 user interface is accept the end user license agreement. And we can go to settings and we can validate that our license model has been accepted. And it has. If you take a look at this now, the new license type says AWS Marketplace and three nodes being licensed. This also is reflected now in the AWS License Manager console. Real-time usage and entitlements for our license is now enabled with this new licensing model. We'll demo that by taking a look at the number of nodes in our cluster and then increasing that number of nodes. As you can see, this is a three node cluster currently. And what we can do is go to the EKS management console and we'll increase the number of nodes using a node group. We'll increase the number of nodes in our cluster by two to create a total of five nodes in our cluster. Let's use a kubectl command check the number of nodes. Our number of nodes is now five. Let's go over to Casting K10 and refresh the licensing, set, the licensing model. As you can see now, five nodes are now reflected from the license. Let's refresh our AWS License Manager console. And you can see that this is also reflected here as well. We're now using five of our purchased 10 nodes of licensing. If we shrink the number of nodes in our cluster, this is also reflected in real time. We're setting our, our Kubernetes cluster back to three nodes. Let's validate our clusters now at three nodes. And let's go back to casting K10 and see if that number of nodes is reflected in our license. Let's refresh. And now, as you can see, the number of nodes reflected in casting K10 is three and the number of nodes reflected in the AWS License Manager is now three. What's also enabled by this new licensing model is to use the same license even for external clusters. In this demo, we'll show a single node edge deployment of Kubernetes managed outside of Amazon. So we're gonna use the self-managed Kubernetes option. And we're going to follow the instructions given on the screen to connect our AWS licensing model to our external Kubernetes cluster. Let's enable all the commands here, as you can see, on our single node Kubernetes cluster. Just by pasting in the commands given from the AWS console into this Kubernetes cluster, we're enabling the connection into the AWS licensing manager. This will also install Casting K10 into this new 
external Kubernetes cluster. Let's accept the end user license agreement. And we'll validate that we are now licensing our external Kubernetes cluster with the AWS Marketplace for Containers Anywhere. As you can see, once we refresh this, this license is being reflected in our 10 max usage. That's it for our demo. Thank you for looking at AWS Marketplace for Containers Anywhere with Casting K10 by Veeam.